Hello everybody! So last time I tried the PC Engine's box, I did an installation to an SD card that is here. But that was just to confirm that the board works. So the final setup is going to involve a Wi-Fi card that hasn't arrived yet and MSATA for storage with 32 gigs, so I can also use uh, to store log files. So let's get to it. First thing is to open the case. It's metal and it's a bit of a brute force process. Then we just need to get the micro by the MSATA disk, force it in as an angle and then push it down. And it clicks, so there is no need to screw anything in. I just see that there are, you know, these levers on all slots, not levers, the clips, so the card should stay in place without any extra tooling, which is great. Now that everything is connected and in place, we can open PuTTY. Connect to the serial port, it's USB 0, 15, 100, okay, and yeah, now it's good, and I can power the board on, and we should see the boot process. Good. Yeah, it is there. F10 to, for boot menu. It has already detected the MSATA disk, so that's where we're going to install to. We go to USB boot, and the boot configure already gives me the same serial port speed, so the kernel flag is properly set to give me proper serial output, although it's a bit rubbish in the beginning. Instructions previously told me that I should disconnect and use a different speed, but as I can see, it uses the same speed as the motherboard BIOS, so maybe it's a change to, to PFSense installer. Let's see how this goes. Okay, any terminal type because it always gets screwed anyway. I accept the license. I will install PFSense, default key map, UFS is fine. This installation is really fast, the installation has finished, I don't want to do any final modifications and I can reboot and let's see once it, I come with, the, let's see if I can already remove the USB okay, BIOS, let's see if it's gonna go straight to the MSATA or if I should for the first time no, I don't have to do anything. It boots from the MSATA, I can see the light blinking there. Boots faster than the uh, SD card for sure. Or at least that's the impression I have, but should be faster. It should beep soon.
here we are it's all good so what I do now is just turn it off 6 to halt yes confirm and it's off well that's it as you can see the process is very easy oh it wasn't off yet well so feel free to try and enjoy and you know get rid of your old firewall and put something more reliable more advanced and more capable to protect your home or do your private network or whatever you like it thanks for watching and yeah next time